From 2019 to 2022, the amount of fatal drug overdoses in the state has steadily increased. In fact, the number of people who died more than doubled in those four years. Now there's a push to get harm reducing products into the hands of Oklahomans. The OK Ready cam campaign says in nearly 40% of overdoses, someone else was present at the time. They say having Narcan on hand could save someone's life, but that's not the only harm reducing tool that can make a difference. A new vending machine equipped with several life-saving instruments has been installed in Delaware County. Two News Oklahoma's Braden Bates shares what's inside. This looks like your standard issue vending machine. However, when you reach inside, you grab things that may save a life. Along with Narcan, wound care kits, pregnancy tests, condoms, and even medicine deactivator kits are included. Brandy Myers knows far too well the impact life-saving tools can have. For me personally, um, I have friends who have died from overdose. Um, like they could still be here today if I would have had access to these things. Myers works at Grand Mental Health. It's the same organization that showed off what they're calling a harm reduction vending machine, the first of its kind in Jay. By sharing my story, I am able to let them know that there are other people that are like them and that those people are actually here to help. So. She's one of those people who can help. Along with other staff members, she understands the impact this machine will have on the community. Knowing that people are getting the help that they need and that lives are literally being saved um, is huge. While we've told you Narcan vending machines started popping up in Oklahoma, this machine can offer more. Um, it's vital. Um, Grand Mental Health and the Delaware County Community Partnership partnered together to make this happen. It's part of the Rural Opioid Response Program. It is one of the first within rural Oklahoma, and so we're so excited for it to be within our community. From 2018 to 2022, 25 people died as a result of an overdose. Of those 25 people, 11 were in 2022. Wound care kit. That's really cool. Staff here at Grand Mental Health tell me that these resources are free to the public. NJ, Braden Bates, 2 News, Oklahoma. The vending machine is open 24-7 and located outside Grand Mental Health in Jay.